welcome to my youtube channel let's continue modeling the kit bash i have deleted this face because it's going to make uh, some shading issues and bad topology and something weird so i want to select all those uh, vertices surrounding this circular edge over there so just i want to extrude it so let's do it for the other part hold on shift select then control let's select it also to extrude it in i think uh, all those vertices are selected selected so let's it extrude as to scale it scale it in just a little bit i think uh, this is not bad just like this it will extrude then S to scale again then I want to grab it uh, inward hit G I think uh, on X axis so just I want to bridge edge loops and make a bridge in between these two sections I'm gonna be using loop tools to bridge these two sections as shown here but this i think it's bad so let's uh, set twist to zero and see what you have so it's fine now it's good as shown here so just segments one so i want to add uh, some supporting edge loops control r the supporting edge loops slide it closer to this edge then control r slide it closer to this edge i think it's uh, fine so i want to work on this uh, section over here control r again control z control r let's make it the uh, a bit sharp then control control r make this uh, edge a bit sharp and let's see what we have i think it's not bad so let's see uh, i think i should uh, make this edge a bit sharper control r Then the other edge as well, Control R. A to select all, Shift N to recalculate the normals, M to merge by distance. It's good. So let's see what we have. Tap into object mode. I think it's not bad. Yes, it's good and not bad anyway. And that's it for this piece and this section. Let's see what you have. I think I should add some supporting loop cuts to make some edges sharper. Then tap into edit mode, go over here. And this part, so we want to select this uh, control. So let's select this. Select this edge loop. Hit it twice, then move it much more closer to this edge. Let's add subdivision surface modifier. Let's select all shift and M to merge by distance. I think it's uh, fine. Let's see the this edge is sharp at this corner, and it's uh, fine and great. I think I should slide some vertices. We have this vertex and this vertex should be slide 
slide it to this area and this should be slided to this area also so rub it on x then type negative 0 0.16 like this select this vertex grab it on xg x then point 0.16 hit enter like this so tap into object mode so let's see what we have just i want to add some final touches to this great shape and amazing topology i think it's fine we have no problem with that so i just want to extrude and uh, play around with some values So let's add slides. I want to add another look at control or over here. So slide it closer to this part, to this edge over here. So I want to select this loop cut. and alt s let's add some loop cuts control r and slide it i'll add another loop cut i think it's uh, fine A to select all then shift and to recalculate normals and to merge by distance tap into object mode i have added some added a slice to this edge like this and let's see what we have i think it's amazing great so let's continue select this vertex hold down control select all these vertices i want to so let's try bevel shift control b control z Shift Ctrl B is go, going to bevel each, uh, each vertex, but you want to bevel the edge. Just like this, Ctrl R to add another look at. I'm going to add uh, more detail. Alt S. Just like this, Ctrl R. To add uh, amazing tiny details, Ctrl R also. Just like this, A, Shift, N, M to merge by distance. Let's apply subdivision surface modifier. And I've created this amazing kit bash as shown here. Peace. It's a great kit bash piece. And that's it for this tutorial in the next part or in the next tutorial i will continue joining to joining to kitbash mechanical piece thanks for watching